We just got our first proper look at Cabal in Mortal Kombat 2021, the movie, so let's check it out. I totally passed this by earlier when I was flicking through Twitter and I seen it and I just gave it a little like as I popped on past. I thought, oh, it's just a cool poster that they've just dropped. But nah, I didn't even notice that Cabal is in it right here over at the far right behind Molina. So they've obviously kind of set it up like good guys Earthrealm on the left and then the bad guys Shang Tsung and all his crew and Outworld people on the right. It goes Scorpion, Jack, Sonya, Cole Young on the left and Sub-Zero, Shang Tsung, Molina and Cabal on the right. And from what we can see about Cabal's design here, it does look very MK11, which I'm really happy about because in MK11 he was actually one of my favourite characters to play as in that game and I always thought his design in that game was pretty sick. We've only seen tiny little quick glimpses of him here or there in the trailer but it's pretty blurry but I do think that we can see some of his arms and some of his charred up skin. It will just be really interesting to see where Cabal's allegiances lie in this film as throughout Mortal Kombat history he's kind of went in between good guy and bad guy. He has been a member of the Black Dragon and Red Dragon gang, same as Kano, so it will be interesting to see if he has any interactions with Kano throughout the film. And he has also been a police officer as he was reformed from the Black Dragon clan eh, alongside Striker, but he does get burned up in MK9, then resurrected by Kano and Shang Tsung to then become the, the cabal we all know and love with the mask and, and, and the sticks. But then eh, he does eventually die die and he ends up coming back as a revenant uh, of Quan Chi I believe. Uh, so it'll just be interesting to see what kind of cabal they are going for in this film and what part he will have to play. I do think in one of the trailers we do see uh, Liu Kang using his fire dragon uh, fatality on him so I do wonder uh, if he's going to make it through this film. I'm sceptical that he will make it to the end uh, but yeah it's just great to see him. I can't wait to see his fight and style in the movie and what they do with him. But let me know in the comments what do you all make of his design. Uh, I think it's badass, I think it's really cool looking. His helmet almost looks kind of like uh, Astartes, do you know what I mean? Like uh, from the 40k universe. But uh, yeah, he's looking good, I'm loving all the tubes and all that on him. He's looking very MK11 in my opinion and yeah, he doesn't look out of place here at all. I'm so hyped for this movie. Hurry up, April 16th. So yeah, let's have a chat down in the comments. If you're new here, subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, like. And as always, thanks for watching and good night.